Hey all, Russ here, RV TV. Welcome. I am leaving this South Cove right here at Lake Mead. This is a new place for me to come back to for sure. Matter of fact, I'm going to launch a drone real quick. We'll get a little aerial before we get out of here. Up we go. Yeah, I had lunch here. I was down there in the van. Right down where those campers are. Just let the doors of the van open and just enjoyed the view for a while. Quite a few boats. You can see them coming in and out. There's Lake Mead. Look how low the water is. Man, that's low. That's amazing. Where I was parked in the van, that would have been underwater in uh, other times. There's our parking lots. I'm sure there's places to get packed in different times. Look at the mountains. <laughs> I really enjoyed it here. I'm coming back for sure. Don't know when exactly, but definitely coming back here. Plus, I want to check out the west, uh, the Grand Canyon West Rim there. Alrighty, reluctantly I'm gonna land and we're gonna head on out of here. We'll, I'll film going out of here uh, when we get over that Dolan Springs. But what a beautiful day, beautiful trip, great video, all of it. Here we go. Wow, a couple boats coming in now. I know the camera doesn't show it, but this is one steep ramp. The incline on that has got to be 20 degrees, I bet. Somewhere on there, maybe not. Sure looks like it. <laughs> All right, we're going to climb back up this hill. But this place is well kept. All of it. I didn't go over and talk to any of the campers. I just didn't want to be around people today, but social distancing. But I'm definitely going to check this out. If anyone knows, have, has any information on the South Cove here at Lake Mead, let me know. Email it. All right, well, let's climb out this beautiful little valley here. I bet the stargazing here would be perfect too because you got the water, fishing, boating, the whole nine yards right here. And you know, this is far enough out of the way. I mean, this is one way in and one way out. There's no two ways into this place. So I think this is a good one. I'll definitely come back here. see the color of the rock climbing out of here that sun's hitting it good Just gonna let the camera run. You you're seeing what I'm seeing.
you know, even for day use, I mean, it's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Boy, those flowers are really colorful yet here. Very colorful. zero cell service down there. I just now picked up one bar climbing the hill here. But still, that's pretty good. I mean, we are way out here. Look at them big rock cliffs up there. Been there forever. We made it. This is where we turned down. Yeah, that sign off the left, it said private road or something there. Looks official. This is the dirt road. Well, the camera's straight in the sun. It's going to start heating up, so I'm going to cut her off. I'll kick it on uh, once we get it down the road a ways. We already filmed all this area anyway, so I'll be back in a while. Welcome back. Here's the forest. Here's Joshua Tree Forest. We flew the drone here. Right up here is the turnoff to go up to uh, the Grand Canyon West. Look at them. I, I'm I'm still in awe. Look at all this. There, here's the road. It's just a sea of them. I think that's one of the most unique things I've ever filmed right here. I've never seen anything like it. So hopefully when they get that uh, Grand Canyon open back up, get up here. I don't know, hopefully sometime this year can get back up this way. Alrighty, let's do some miles. There's a gas station I stopped earlier. That kid was right. He goes, it is something to see, all those trees. He was absolutely right. There's all that farm equipment. Okay, right up here to the left, that's the road we came in on. That would take you down to Kingman. But we're not going to go back that way. I'm going to go straight. I kind of Google mapped this. 
See that road there? Look at that big parking area. There was some rigs parked there when I came up. Anyway, uh, we're going to go through Dolan Springs, and then we end up right on Highway 93. It's really not that far, about maybe 20 miles. There's a lot of people that live out here. You just see, you, as far back as you can see, there's homes. Little dirt roads and homes. Look at all the lines in those power poles, too. Look at all them things. <laughs> but yeah, there's a ton of people living out here. Joshua trees are getting fewer. There's still a few though. like a little church, a pink church. I think we're getting pretty close at Dolan Springs. And this looks like a school, public school here on the left. All the schools are shut down the rest of the year, I believe. Pretty good size. All right, this looks like town. Dolan Springs, Arizona. I'm sure there's history here. Chamber of Commerce. Probably nothing's open though. Well, when I return later in the year, we'll check out. I want to go back to that chloride, too, and check out that little town. See, there's little restaurants, markets. They're all closed. This must be like their little downtown district here. Little stores. Hot diggity dog has a little cafe. <laughs> yeah, darn. Yeah, everything's just closed up. Well, we'll check it another day, though. Once again, this is Dolan Springs. Hey, dollar store. Every town has a dollar store now. All right, that's it. There's Dolan Springs. <laughs> Northern Arizona, wide open, high mountain desert. And here's Highway 93. 
Ah, uh, good. I'm going to stop here. Grab something to drink. Take a break a minute. the price of fuel even at these that's over a buck a gallon more than in town be sure to fill your tanks where you come up here <laughs> but this van I get such good mileage I didn't need any fuel all right well cut over here to highway 93 probably about 15 18 miles north of Kingman we're right back down there. Looks like a lot of road construction here. You know, this is uh, 93. They're turning in this into that uh, interstate, Interstate 11. Gonna follow those guys. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed the series. What a great trip! Mead View, Lake Mead, Grand Canyon, West Rim, almost. Too bad they weren't open. In that Joshua Tree Forest, my goodness. All right, journey continues. Talk soon.